round Point of Air, he came with vessels three. He'd harried the shores of Erin Fair, a piteous sight to see. Tar and town he'd stripped them bare, a merciless man was he. And now he'd sailed to his Southland lair, in safety there to be. Sea captain, three tall English craft, reach out from Ramsey Bay. He gripped his sword and grimly laughed, we fall on an evil day. But the wine is poured and must e'en be quaffed, we'll fight it as we may. Welcome the cup that holds the draft to rovers bold and gay. Carrick Fergus is smoking yet in Larn, the maids still weep. Except to fight your hearts be set, in English jail you'll sleep. But light I reckon their fume and fret, they buy me not so cheap. Howe'er those dogs my ship may get, she'll be ten fathoms deep. The French they rage like flaming fire, like beasts that seek to flee. The English fought with deadly ire, and dumb as dumb could be. With wrath and scorn that would not tire, or doubt of victory. How should the spawn of prison mire resist the kings of the sea? Through ragged holes the sea came fast, Captain, she sinks, they cried. Amen, fight on while she may last, the bold Thoreau replied. The English grape shot rattled past, his arm fell by his side, and crashing fell his tall foremast, and his men despairing died. I yield me not, Thoreau, he said, nor ye while I command. Hers be out of steel or lead, ain't I there as ye stand? His crew were mad with craven dread, and fear their anger fanned, and a traitor shot brave Thuro sped from his own men's felon hand. And never since the world began was braver tar than he, for he that doth the best he can, how may he better be? So fill your cup and fill your can and pledge him lustily, and stand as ye drink to a valiant man, though he was your enemy.